feel the pressure. And Zeki around him as well, also doing poorly. But life goes on. Kakadu and Takayasu. Kakadu and Takayasu. Mirror Records, the Ozeki 3 and 1 doing best of the Ozeki. Takayasu with that uh, one standout victory, defeating Harum Fuji. That man is in a deep hole. One and three at the start. A little bit, a two and two. So uh, they must be feeling the pressure of the Ozeki, so they should be. be wondering whether they should be taken aside or their work others should be taken aside and say, well, okay, what's going on here? These guys are supposed to be Ozeki. And they shouldn't be putting up these kind of performances. Especially the first week. Those five days. You just joined us. This is uh, we have what one sole leader, and that is Hakoho, and that's the first time that's happened in 12 years. After four days, one man leading on his own, and it was a person you would never think of way back then in 2001 September. Kitazakura, who's now Shikide Wakata, he was the sole leader. Minus shoot of 13 back then. Takayasu, first man to get uh, uh, Kim Boshi as a Heisei man. Uh, the Heisei era. But uh, he's had a pretty tough go of it. And once again he takes on and Ozeki here, all the top rankers for him in the first week. Uh, they've only met twice, and a win each. Strangely enough, Takayasu won quite well with a thrusting attack, which he is very good at. Also, quite surprisingly, it's just that Kakadu can normally fend those off. If Takayasu comes with a thrusting attack, he needs to hit them well, because Kakadu does have good lateral movement. He's not particularly strong, but he's clever. Drives into Takayasu. Takayasu kind of hopping there. He has the Mawashi grip. That's not normally his game. Tries to force up the Ozeki. The Ozeki goes back and down. Almost throws down Takayasu. Now a deep Morizashi. Takayasu is very high here. And all Kakadu has to do is spin around and lift him out. And he's a, about 20 kilos heavier. But Takayasu in an awkward position where he can't do a lot from here. If he tries to pull a leg trip, he could set up a uh, crush down by Takayasu. And there is there. That's what I was uh, oh. afraid of happening to Takayasu. If he uh, got too far underneath Kakadu, the leg trip would come to play. Because he was way too high. Mm, that's so much. But that was made to happen by Kakadu. Sotogake. Sotogake. Outside leg trip by the Ozeki. So he moves up to four and one. A good struggle. You know, he's not a power Ozeki. Kakadu. He doesn't get it done quickly. He's got to use finesse. And he worked his way into this match. In that awkward position there for Takayasu. He was, well, he was almost in no man's land. He, couldn't try a leg trip himself. 
couldn't lift up the Ozeki from here. He had to just wait to see what the Ozeki's plan was and try to react. And as they spin around here, then Kakadu goes for the outside leg trip, Sotogake, and dumps Takeyasu. Kakadu, so he maintains that one loss. Respectable. Takeyasu, one and four. Tomorrow, Kakadu against Koedo. Takeyasu will fight the local favorite, Ikiyori.